The war in Ukraine is affecting residents here in central Illinois. The Champaign family went to Ukraine nearly 20 years ago to adopt their daughter, and now they are shaken after seeing the country destroyed. Fox Illinois' David Pierce spoke with the family on how the conflict in Ukraine is affecting them. Amber, Marina Diatli says it's her lifelong dream to meet her birth mother who lives in Ukraine. She was adopted by a Champagne family when she was just a little over a year old. With the conflict in Russia and Ukraine, it feels like that might be impossible for her to go back and possibly see her mother for the first time. When you really like stop to think about it at night, just not knowing, it's like the unknown that makes everyone so terrified. Marina Diatli and her adoptive family love each other dearly, but with the current conflict the country is in, she says the thought of not knowing her Ukrainian mother still makes her wonder. But it's also making me realize how much I want to fight for it and how much I'm willing to, like, how much I'm willing to give to find her and to just, like, know her. While living in Champaign, Marina's parents, Ed and Kamala, say they are heartbroken by what they're seeing on TV after the positive moments they shared with citizens leading up to Marina's adoption. The people were so warm and treated us like family, really. Really took a lot of time to talk to us about the history of Ukraine and different buildings and events when we were with him. Although Marina grew up in Champaign, her parents say they've always celebrated her heritage. So there are restaurants that we would go eat at, and every year there's um, a Ukrainian independence festival, which hasn't happened for the last two years because of COVID, I believe. But um, anyway, so every year since she came home, we have gone to the Ukrainian independence festival. Marina says when the day finally comes, she's nervous to meet her birth mother because she doesn't speak fluent Ukrainian. But she says she hopes the love they'll share will make it easier. Um, it's not going to be something that I talk about. I'm going to hug her. I'm going to hold her. I'm going to memorize her face. The Dialis tell me they wish Ukraine peace and safety as the conflict carries on. They hope that one day they can take Marina back to Ukraine and give her an experience she's been missing since she was a baby. In studio reporting, I'm David Pierce. Back to you.